don't move. Wouldn't dream of it. It's been a while since I had a go this close. You would do better to keep your mouth shut. You might stay alive a bit longer. I suppose so. Wouldn't be half as much fun though, would it? Start walking. It's unusual for a woman telling me what to do. I'm not sure if I like it. By saying that, you're not really much of a woman, are you? More like a pretty little girl. A little girl who's going to carve your face in with this blade if you don't shut up. Oh, such fighting talk from a pretty young lady. Can't you walk in silence for more than two seconds? I mean, I could do, but we got a long way to go, so I thought I'd liven things up a little bit. It's going to be difficult to do that if you're dead, and I'm supposed to bring you back alive. For what purpose? So they can kill me instead, because I'm such a bad guy. Oh yeah, because what you did is what good people do, isn't it? So what? A guy's got to have a bit of fun. Yeah, most people's idea of fun doesn't usually involve slitting the throat of the prince. Yeah, but you have to admit he was a bit of an arrogant prick. Here's an idea. How about you let me go, and I promise I won't kill you? Okay, fair enough, I understand. I'm not an easy person to trust, but I am good at keeping secrets. What if I tell you a secret first? What if I told you where your brother is? Go ahead. You'd be one of hundreds that have used it against me. Do you know the difference between me and the hundreds? You're still alive? No. I was at the camp your brother was taken to. I heard he screamed as his Ben touched him with a hot poker. And let me tell you, he didn't shut up then. But what can I say? I'm an exceptionally good listener. You think I don't know who you are, Ruby Johnstone? Our people, we have a network, you see. We hear things. We hear about people like you getting rid of people like us for a bit of extra cash. Where is he? So what was that about letting me go? Where is Sean? Consider loosening these binds and I'll consider telling you. I'm not pissing about, Isaac. Where is he? These binds aren't getting any looser. I'm the one with the sword pressed against your neck and I swear to God you have about ten seconds before I do something about it. But the thing is, I think I have longer than ten seconds. See, my trick, Ruby, I get people exactly where I want them. It's a bit convenient, don't you think, that I happen to be on the same road you were taking? I told you, didn't I? If you considered letting me go, I might have let you walk away unharmed. But I think it's a bit too late for that. Please, I just wanted to find my brother. You know, he had the same look on his face too. But I think you'll see him again pretty soon. <coughs> Send my regards. <coughs>